Hey, it's Jeff Cooner. Welcome back to another edition of Three Rounds with Cooner, where you, the audience, get to ask me any question you want. Are you ready to rumble? Let's get it on. Arr. Jeff, what are your thoughts on the New York primaries yesterday? Anything surprise you? Uh, two things surprised me. Uh, the level, the amount of Trump's victory, it was uh, historic. He got 60% of the vote. I think now all the energy, all the momentum, all the passion is on his side. He now has a potential glide path to 1,237 delegates. Next week, I think Pennsylvania will pretty much settle it. If Trump wins big there, as well as some of these other Super Tuesday primaries, I believe there will be no stopping him. The second big surprise was Hillary. Um, I think that clearly what happened with her was they stole it. They stole it from Bernie. And there was a lot of voting shenanigans going on. And I can't believe Bernie's people are taking this lying down. Because if they stole an election from me, believe me, you'd be hearing about it. Cooner man, did you hear about all the voting issues people had to deal with in Brooklyn? What gives? It was, it was a disgrace. I mean, it was an absolute disgrace. 125,000 people complained about voting problems. Entire blocks in Brooklyn, literally entire blocks of people on the voting rolls just were gone. They just literally disappeared from the voting rolls. The overwhelming majority were Bernie Sanders supporters. So I think clearly what was going on is the Clinton Democratic machine said by hook or by crook, Madam Hillary must beat Bernie and beat him good. I think the fix was in and they stole it from Bernie right from underneath his nose. Jeff, what do you think about Hollywood making a Boston Marathon movie? Do you think it's too soon? Uh, I know some of the family members of the victims feel it's too soon. I always defer to them on issues like this. Uh, so if they think it's too soon, I want to be respectful. Honestly, I don't think it is too soon. Um, look, I think that Mark Wahlberg is doing the city a favor. I think he's doing ultimately the friends and family members of the victims a favor. Uh, this was a major terrorist attack on American soil uh, that I think needs the story needs to be told. I think Mark Wahlberg is perfectly suited to tell it. I'll tell you this, when that movie comes out, I'll be the first in line to buy a ticket. My friends, that's it for another three rounds with Cooner. I'll be taking more of your questions next week. And I'm still, yes intellectual talk radio heavyweight champion of the world. Arr. Do you want to go three rounds with Cooner? Submit your questions now on Twitter or Facebook.